This upgrades it all, though, to strong essence, right? Uh, yes, I believe so. Okay, right. No, I think you're right then. I think we've done all of them except the strong ones, so I think that's good. Um, and I can also just throw in a few stacks of seeds as well into, into the bioreactor. We've got a couple of fields out here, actually, that don't have much going on. Like, the harvesters aren't hooked up yet. Mm, you're right. But I'm not sure what you want to put there. Oh, yeah, no, I haven't decided either. I think we still need to make a couple of seeds, like the skeleton seeds and the leather oh, seeds. Oh, yeah, yeah. We didn't make those at all, did we? No. Shall I get on making some of those seeds yeah, then? Yeah, I'm going to put this blaze essence through and make it into blaze rods because I don't think I've got an automated crafting table doing that yet. And I think if I if I still have an automated crafting table somewhere in this chest system, I'll be able to show people how I did it. Oh, yeah, I've got one here. I'm not sure they'll really be interested. Maybe they will. Oh, I'm sure they will. I'm sure they will. So, basically... Um, this is all going to just go wrong, probably. Um, well, sometimes everything has to go wrong before it can go right. But what I'll do is I'll just shove one in here. So if I shove this... I assume I haven't got any blades being done. I can. I will just double check. So this one does di makes diamonds. This one makes ender eyes. This one makes glowstone. This one makes... Oh, this one does make blaze. So I don't need one for blaze. So if I put 64 blaze in there... It starts making the blaze rods and they come out, you see? Ah, uh, nice. So it looks like if I just grab all the blaze essence out of here... Oh, we can we can change that chest, uh, uh, change that, that barrel. Chest out. Okay. Okay, so I'll, I'll put that all in here. And that'll all feed through to upstairs. Should we change okay. a barrel to diamonds? Yep, let's change, change that blaze barrel to diamonds then. Okay, I'll put the diamond in there. How do we do this then? Shift, right click. I don't think we need the glowstone either. And put diamond in there. There we go. Oh, right, yeah. So basically we can we can remove every essence that we have a crafting table for. Uh, yes. So where does the strong essence go once it's been made? Into the magical crops chest? I assume it will go into the magical crops. I don't actually know. I think it just goes into the standard sorting system. Yeah. Uh, so I guess you can find out. Uh, there's there's empty space. Oh, no, no. There's a regular essence here. Oh, there's, here's 20, 20 strong essence. Okay, perfect. Okay, cool. Uh, do we have... We don't have a chest for gold bars, so I will make a chest for gold bars. I need okay. seeds as well, actually. You've got any... one for diamonds, that's cool. Do you see any seeds? I think I put most of them by the pettings. Oh, no, here's some seeds. So we need bones for the bone seeds and uh, cow cow leather for the cow seeds. Yep. Um, got any leather knocking around? Or did we use it all making the... Um... Uh, I've got nine here. Oh, perfect. And I've got five bones as well. Oh, sweet. We can finally do those. Rockin'. All right, so this means we can finally get, like, infinite bone meal. Oh, and then we can use it in the fertilizing systems. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, cool yeah, because beans. you can actually put um, bones into sprinklers as well, can't you? Uh, can you? Yeah, yeah, there's, like, a, an, an ammo oh, slot. Oh, yeah, you're right, you can. And they shoot bones instead of water, which is apparently much better for plants. Well, who knew? Yeah. This wall, I'll tidy it up in a bit, but I think for now, I just want to see if I can get everything into it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We're running out of space for cotton. I could do with some more upgrades, actually. Okay, skeleton seed in place. And now a cow seed. Oh, yeah. I've got enough strong essence for a couple more crops. Um, right. What do you think we need from the strong... I'll see what I can use strong essence for. And so see what, what the best seed is for us to make. Okay. But these are all like the, um, the monster. This is the monster tier, isn't it? So yeah. we use it for like... Um, Iron seeds? Have we got iron seeds yet? Yeah, we should have iron seeds, yep. Lapis seeds. Yep. Experience seeds, wow. I've got those. Nether seeds kind of suck because it just gets you nether rack. Oh, we can make creeper seeds for gunpowder. Hmm. You can make gunpowder by crushing up um, gravel, though. It's not, not too bad. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, slime seeds for slime balls. Oh, no, we get that from the uh, from the sludge. Do we get slime balls from sludge? Do we not? We, we've got, like, oh, we, no, we get gelatinous slime. From sludge. Do we? I don't know. We have a barrel full of it. Well, I think that's that's. Well, but I think that's where it came. I think we got that from before, though. Oh right. Oh, okay. As long we as we got enough. Also, make uh, spider seeds. I think you get like um, string from that. Oh. But we got we got cotton for that, so we don't need that. Silk so, ghast. Oh, ghast seeds for I guess ghast tears. Hmm. But you need four of those to get a seed. So we'd have to go ghast hunting. Okay. And there's lead seeds or quartz seeds, ruby sapphire and all those. Aluminum? Ardite? Wow. Oh, good grief. 
there's a there's a lot of seeds you can make with this, including like some Thorncraft stuff, infused shard seeds. Oh, that might be useful. Do you, th- do you actually think that'd be useful? Mm, not for us, really. Maybe. <laughs> uh, so and- we've got iron, silver, lead, gold, tin, and copper. But right. no aluminium. No aluminium. No platinum. Did you say lead? No. Yeah, we got lead. Yeah, we got lead. And we got silver. Uh, yeah. So we we could make aluminium. That's one thing. Okay. I'll make an aluminium seed. Um, sure. Lapis seeds, but we why, why would you need lapis? Lapis is. Um, we might have that already. Actually, we don't. Actually, maybe we don't. I don't know if we have lapis. Peridot? We might have lapis. I'll just double check. Four seeds. We can make four seeds. We've got those. Oh, okay. Um, I'll make I'll make aluminium seeds then, because that's the big one that we that we need. I haven't rigged up the four seeds though, actually. Oh. Maybe that's something I could do. Okay, I'll do that one now. See the four seeds are in here. They look weird. They're like this. And I'm not sure how we use them. Is can we like... use them to oh yeah, yeah. Can we use them to get like no, just, four stuff? Just in a circle, apparently. So what I will do is I will rig it up as I rigged up the others. Does that give us four stuff. shards? Uh, <laughs> yeah. I don't Force, know. Force gems, yeah. Oh, oh Brett cool, joined the cool. game and he crashes the server every time he joins. Oh, no. Sorry sorry in advance, guys. He has actually crashed the server. Yeah, I, I can't believe it. He is literally... <laughs> Hitler. Uh, <laughs> literally like... The, the 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 destroyer of service. <laughs> Brent Copeland, destroyer of service. Like he, he's done it so often, you wouldn't believe. Oh, dead server It's just party. always a problem for him. <laughs> I don't know why. So we fixed the server. Brent's uh, fine. Don't worry about him. Yeah. Uh, so I've got this crafting table up here, and I've got some. I haven't got any force uh, essence. Okay, there we are. Oh. And. Um, so what I'll do is I'll have to do this quite quickly because if I don't if I don't do it quickly enough, all of all of these everything that's coming out of these inventories will just go into this crafting table. Oh right, and and do oh, oh right, and, and it won't be able to do anything with it, so it'll just be useless. Yeah, it'll jam it up. So Ooh. let's put that in there and um, change that, and then oh, we've got this. some we've got some glow bugs here. Right, so this will whitelist only false essence going in but a bunch of stuff will go in that's the wrong thing and that's fine okay i need another server actually to power this on the way out i have to make one of those but if i put the recipe in like this um and then put those in there there you go it's making force gems nice so now any force essence that comes in off the farm or anywhere will get made into force gems go up around the system well, blah 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 how else can you get like force gems because Darkcraft uses force gems as like a power source, doesn't it? Like you you, mil- you you harvest them as like a finite natural resource, right? Yeah. So don't we haven't we like created something crazy now that we can actually make force gems from nothing? Uh maybe. Maybe. Well, I don't know if it's that crazy. Oh, okay. Maybe I'm just, like, overthinking things. I suppose we could use it as a power source. We could have the force gems pumping into... Oh, that's not a bad idea, Shin. A couple of force engines. We've got plenty of power anyway with the biofuel. I'm not yeah. too worried about, like, That's power. crazy, though. I mean, it, it's weird because the biggest problem in the world right now, arguably, is <laughs> um, the fact that, you know, we, ha- we have to burn these... Hor- we have to use these natural resources to get power. But here on Shin's farm... It's not the case. We can just literally use 100% renewable, super powerful, like, power items. Yeah. So it's like being able to grow oil on a tree. Quite precisely. Yeah. Or coal. Well, no, because the thing is, there's no pollutants here. Well, apart from the sewage, but, you know. Yeah. Um, do we have any aluminium? I almost said aluminium there. Uh, we we might not do. We might not do. How, how do I, is, is that an alloy? Do I need to... Or do I, or no, I like, think it's just an ore, but it's bauxite ore. It's bauxite ore. Yeah. Uh, I wasn't looking for that. Okay, I'll have another look. That's what it's called. It's part of um, mariculture, I believe. Oh, that's fish farming. We should probably do some fish farming. But I looked into mariculture and it's super complicated, so I need to take another look at it, I think. It's a bit... Yeah, it's a bit much. Uh, also, actually, we need to get some cool trees as well, because there's a whole bunch of extra trees now added in this mod pack. 
that have like, and you normally have like, you know, cherries, nuts, bananas, all these things on trees. Yeah. But there's actually some really cool new mutated trees that let you, again, just grow random things from the world on trees. That sounds great. But we need to use the Mutatron to get those, and I'm not quite sure how that works either. Uh, I think we have to get pollen. Oh, so we do need bees. So we're going to need a bee because I think you right. have to pay a pollen for each tree mutation. Oh, so oh, basically, it's, like... it's, it's kind of like machine. If you were doing it with a machine, oh right, it would. Um, yeah. The last kind of hives I used were just like the normal forestry ones, though, and I heard that like the gendistry ones are really good. The gendistry, gendistry machines are the same as what we're using, so the Mutatron type things, but there might be even better kind of hives that are designed to get pollen out. So maybe oh. there's a specific gendistry beehive that's different to the normal hives. But I thought the gendistry machines were the things that actually let you modify or breed the bees. Ah, uh, nice. Okay, right, right, okay, right. Maybe. So, so all we really need is like a couple of bees just working up to no good, making pollen in our neighbourhood. Yeah. All right, sweet. Okay. Working ideally nine to five. What a way to make pollen. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> that, that works too. That works too. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm, I'm looking at this wheat field now and I, and I feel like I want to change that wheat field. Um, what kind of seeds do we have? I've got some, well, we don't want a mandrake field. Um, and we can't, oh, we can't use chili seeds because the, um, the machines won't harvest those, right? Oh, uh, sorry. I'm busy. <laughs> sorry sorry what was that get back to me no what was it god ask again so we can't we can't use chilies because the harvest the harvesters the um the oh, mine factories yeah. won't 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 just suck it leave up. those for now that's right. not important okay um i think you need to prepare yourself for a trip to the twilight forest and yeah. also set up those new scenes the bode seeds and the um seeds. oh yeah yeah because i've got them now Do i've you... got i've got a cow seed and a skeleton seed. Oh, I tell you what, I could replace the, the wheat farm up there with a cow farm. What okay, do you reckon? Okay, that sounds good. And what's the one next to it? Is cotton. That... Replace that as well. Oh, no, no, no. Don't we... Isn't cotton a good thing to have? We've though? got 53 stacks of stuff. Of cotton? Yeah. Well, that means we've probably got like about a stack of wool, though, because it's, it takes a lot to make one wool. I think we've got about 10 stacks of wool. Uh, okay. I think we'll be all right. All right. Well, you know, you can, you can only have like so much fluff in your pillows, so I'm going to... Can you? Well, no, maybe, maybe you can't, although I'm confident that you can, that pillows have like a finite amount of room inside them that you can fill with just fluff. But maybe maybe they don't. Maybe they are this surreal kind of TARDIS style. Um, is, it, is it called the TARDIS effect? What? When something is small on the outside but bigger on the inside. Oh, uh, maybe. Yeah, it's a, nice, thought, it's a nice name for it. I thought there was like a special word for it, but maybe there wasn't. I don't know. It's fine. I think, yeah, I think that's cool. I'm trying to get underneath the... Um, do we use a sprinkler on the second wheat field? Uh, yeah, the sprinklers, because we don't have water sources on them, so, so the sprinklers function as a kind of water source. So there's a planter as well. I'm trying to get to it, but I can't work out how we got to it. Uh, how do I get underneath this bad boy? I think you might just have to dig dig your way under. Okay, I'm going in. It might going not be in. part of the normal system. Oh, I see, I see. Now I see the pipes now, so yeah, I can do this. I don't know whether that's how rigged up that is i don't know whether it's rigged up in the same way um just because do you remember the other ones were done in a slightly complicated way oh my god so many seeds in here no yeah no wonder we got seed overflow that's why we had so many seeds being made before we can use them it's fine we'll use them for um, biofuel oh yeah yeah good point yeah 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 i forgot we could use that yeah that's a good use for seeds it's a good use for sort of saplings as well, often. Should we make this one field skeleton and cow, or just one? Um, uh, if you have a servo and stuff and you can actually control it, then you can choose up to you. But oh, right. Um, if the me... point is that I don't think that... I think that's just set up to receive only... It's up to you. I don't know. Um, Find out. Figure it out, Shin. Okay, let's see. Well, we've got, like, some weird red... Red cubic wires here. It says they're called energy conduits. Right, that's a power one. Right, okay. So that's power. Um, next up, we've got these weird item ducts. Now, they transport stuff. I'm not sure they're weird. Uh, okay, we got these totally normal, regular, nothing weird about these things, conducts here. And they transport stuff. But you can't see it because they're opaque. Um, and it's got a blue arrow going in. But this feeds directly from... Oh, right, yes. This feeds from the chest next to the harvester. So it's going to suck those out. 
I see. Right, so it's basically taking the seeds from that chest and pulling them through there. Oh, that's why we get some seeds going in here and some seeds going all the way back to the start. Hmm. Because we had we have seed overflow as well as like wheat overflow because seeds are coming back from the system into our main system. That's right, yeah. So does that mean that you haven't set up like a filter here that only sends seeds to the harvester? Well, or is it that they're full? It, well, th I don't mind them coming back to the system because if, when they mm. come back to the system, like for example, I've just filled the wire reactor with loads of different seeds that came back through. So like redstone seeds, glowstone yeah. seeds, and that's going to make our biofuel, you see, from all these extra seeds that we're right. getting out of the system. Oh, I see. Okay. So we, we should probably leave these and use that as fuel because all that wheat and seed, or those seeds are the perfect fuel. Uh, seeds, are the, the problem is, is that if you just only use the, the normal seeds and not mix, a mixture, yeah. it will generate nine times or, or eight, in fact, 81 times less. But we've got so many seeds that we can just throw them in at low efficiency. It doesn't matter. We just I think you're right. Yeah. I'll, I'll seal this up and just leave that as is then because we've got a lot of resources there. And I'll put the, the seeds that we got here into just like the third field or the fourth field, like um, home or. Yeah. Well, yeah, if there's space, then sure. Absolutely. Yeah, because this last field here is just nothing but essence crops, which we don't really need anymore because we've pretty much got all the seeds we need. Okay, cool. So the need for seeds is, is, is less. Satiated. Yes. Yes.